Welcome everybody and welcome back to the Bio Isaac Repentance. Now today, it's a special fun little challenge where basically every red room is open on the map that's possible. And I was thinking, well, I think I, Alexa or someone did this like a while ago. I don't really know except how it works. Oh, we also have Heaven's Call on, that's right. But I'm pretty sure it was pretty cool. So I was going to try the same thing. That looks absolutely wrong. I don't know how to feel about that. But I was going to just see how overpowered you can get based off of one, like, every floor. So 169 rooms, basically. Like, how overpowered is every red room? By going to, like, Hush or Delirium or something afterwards. I don't know. Something like that. So it's going to be a lot of min-maxing. It's going to be easy for the most part. But I'm just kind of curious. I like how the keys are red as well. I'm just curious to see how this map shapes up and see how many fun, cool rooms we get. Also, that's also... A that's also also that's a weird space for the normal super secret room or ultra secret room to be that's, that's very weird actually am i missing something no i don't think so oh secret room is some why is there like an eye right there by the keys what is that okay it's only there and it's gone now all right yeah, I think it makes more sense now. I think what it is, is I'm opening you because I want you to be open. I believe there's a secret room right here. That's why there's no red room. What? Wow. I'm kind of surprised. And stupid at the same time. I'm just going to use Shoop the Whoop. Shoop the Whoop can help us quite a bit, actually. The moon? Okay, where is it then? I was half... No. Well, it's technically only one room. For one floor so i guess it might be a little bit of a double like it's it's just part of the challenge you know sometimes you have to use a forget me now and clear two times 169 rooms to really get the ball going i have mmm but we don't need mmm oh that's right a spirit of evidence i was gonna say how do we get to this item okay that's good then uh the best thing we could really get is R key, which... Or death certificate, I guess, technically. But the eyes are so low, I don't care enough. It's a weird room. I mean, I don't think there's any particular place we have to go. I might get screwed, though. I don't know if we can go out of bounds with this. I don't know what the technicalities are. So I guess it's just best to figure it out immediately. Okay, so it doesn't open the rest. It's open, but I assume that on the map. Okay, so just close it right away. So that would, in fact, be an ultra secret room. Not ultra secret room. Eh, uh, I am air room. Hey, it's a library. I think we just go in uh, circles. Oh, uh, we do have a dice shard now, so we can definitely make something happen if we get like another secret room. I don't know if you can get secret rooms though, out of like a challenge room. Who's that guy? Oh, it's this stupid room again. God, I hate this. Hey, right, let's just not do that. I was able to rewind, which is good. You see, there's eyes there. I think that's the Heaven's Call mod. Because that does, in fact, look like Heaven's Call guy. Looks like there's, like, a little lunar symbol. Okay, right, so let's just not go up there. So that's the top left of the map. I don't know why that happens sometimes. It just does. We don't need keys, because we literally have infinite keys. For the floor, which is all that matters. Unless we forget me now. It's gonna be really funny, like, getting flight halfway through and having to go back through every room. So that way we can min-max to a just much greater extent. Because this is just, how can you min-max 13 floors, basically? Well, how many floors or rooms is there per floor? I mean, that can also spawn item rooms and stuff. I think it, it's pretty cool, I guess. I'll have to remember that there's a dice shard over there. I guess we can at least count how many rooms over we need to go and then link up somewhere. A bedroom? Please don't tell me it's just a random bedroom that's going to lie to me because it's funny. I can at least go in here. Remember all pickups and trinkets? I could be good, I guess. I'll please say I can come in here. I mean, that looks like it's close to the edge, if not the edge itself. Okay, so it is very close to the edge. It's also not even clean. Hey, look. We're gonna need that with a fame. 
Like, this is, of course, just a really fun hypothetical to be like, okay, if you had... Oh, dang it. If you had, like, red key on steroids. Like, that's basically it. And I'm down for it. Because I've always wanted to do this myself. I never watched the video, so I don't know exactly how it goes. Nor do I. I can't this point. Ringworm. I will remember you. And I'll just be on my own merry way. How about that? Sound good? Sound good. Hey, there's our first item room. Our first additional item room. And it's suplex. Suplex is cool. I just don't think it's what we want. Alright, it's telling us that there's a mini boss fight. Which I don't think it's supposed to do, but... I guess it just does that because it wants to. Okay, there's a lot of health. We definitely won't run out of health anytime soon. Lust almost just murked you immediately. I like how it has the... Like, bars on the door. Like, we can't go out there anyways. Ah! Okay, well now we can go... Now we can take this pill. Now we can go back into this curse room that I passed up earlier. Do we have, like... This looks like a... Curse... Da, 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 voodoo head curse room. That's weird. I mean, I might as well just use all these because I don't want to come back in here and waste stuff later. Because I'll also forget about it. Alright, and now we can continue on our way. I think I'm just gonna, like, work my way in, like, a spiral or something cool like that. Oh, well, that's just the perfect lineup right there. And I messed it up because I stepped on a rock. Yep, that sounds about right to me. Yeah, I think I'll just work my way in in, like, a spiral. That'll be cool. Hey, and there's an angel deal going for us. Okay, what do you got, Mr. Angel Deal? Not a whole lot. That That's for sure. I don't think we're going to be doing bad on health. So I don't care about red hearts. Yeah, we're going to have enough soul hearts to cover for us anyways. So it won't be a big deal. Okay, this is the bottom. I thought it was open. Alright, we've done it. We have cleared out like two of the sides basically. I mean, it's basically two sides. Rounding down of course. You know, like what? One, two, like five extra. I don't know, one, two, skip a few. Good enough. I also have a shop next, which is interesting. Because I've been waiting for a shop. And it's worthless. I hate these fog effects so much. I don't know why the fog lags my computer. I despise it. I don't care about your watch battery. Like, why is it a thing? Shop. We have money. We It's worthless. We don't need that anyways. I guess, uh, cool. I, oh, Joker. Yeah. No, I'll take a Joker. Uh, yeah, I will actually go horror mode. I think that's probably good for us. Like, like I was saying, we don't really care for red hearts, so why wouldn't we take this? It opens a lot more options than having red hearts, basically. Alright, well this... I don't think we can get brimstone or anything. Like, I would take it. I do like tiny planet. It's a good item. It's not the worst item in the world. But when you can re-roll... Why not re-roll into something much cooler? And that is not much cooler. Out Conjoined isn't a big deal. I, mean, I guess this would be good for red hearts, but eh. Blow up you two. Haha, <laughs> sucks to suck. There's another shop here. Uh, once again, useless. And now uh, we have reached the other edge of the map. Three-fourths of the way. Oh, we do have a curse room here. Curse room, eh? Yeah. And I guess free entry. I know I'm going to accidentally enter a curse room at some point. I just lose health for no reason. In hindsight, I could have used the dice shard in the double deal and I just didn't. But we'll probably have another double deal somewhere along the line. Like, I have to assume a double deal. I'm pretty sure double deal red rooms can spawn. And now we're back here and we're stuck. I didn't know that was a thing that could happen. Okay, I guess I'll just go through here. Alright, and it's time to repeat loop number two. I'll probably enter that item room with the uh, reroll machine after I complete another loop so that way I can get some money. Well, we already beat, and not envy. Who did we beat? The white one. Pride? Alright, so it's sloth now. So I assume it's not gonna be multiple of the same floors or same bosses. Uh, this counts, I believe. I wouldn't want to accidentally just ruin everything and have to do this all over again. I'd probably just rewind and hope that it works and doesn't crash the game. What do we got here? Holy water? Oh my god. I can move. The fog. It doesn't break my game. Oh, that's beautiful. Smooth running Isaac. And start back to this. Or I just turn on the fogless mod that I had on before. And it's much better now. Hooray, I have 
made the game actually playable. Genius. That looks so cool on the map. I love just how that looks. Also weird having the staircase and the... Like, whatever... Where's my cursor? Ah, can I teleport with the cursor? Ah. See on the map, I'm kind of like trying to point to it. Little puzzle piece looking-esque thing. I mean, that's kind of cool, I guess, having there. And then there's just a backwards L. Just, you know, just some casual Tetris. Have you ever wanted to open up your map? But the map said, let's take up half of your screen? Say no more. With the every Red Room map. Mod. Thing. Oh, a library. We might get Bookworm. Bookworm would be powerful enough. To do a little bit more for Hush. And we do actually just have Bookworm it. Inherently. Alright, well I don't have to use the dice shard on the library anymore. I was contemplating it at some point. Although... I think I'm going to keep Monster Manual. That might make us really overpowered since we're going to have like... Probably every familiar known to man. I think this is the restock machine one. I don't know why I'm blowing you up. Maybe small rock chances? Maybe something cool I guess? I mean, I guess it counts. Hey, Robo Baby, your time has come. Time to give me what you've never wanted to be. At stem cells, that's better. What was that? I I'm a little curious. What item was that? I'm gonna redo it. I just rewinded because I wasn't paying attention. I didn't think it would blow up. Oh, Satanic Bible. Okay. I was just curious because I saw it for like half of a second, but I didn't know what it actually was. Cool. But we have Sharp Cursor now. I like Sharp Cursor. Certainly an item of the time. I'm really gonna do this again. <sighs> this stupid die room is just taking up all my keys. I'm gonna have to do it from this room as well. No, it's because I walked out of it. Okay, I could have just been walking out of the door. And it would have been fine. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. That makes sense to me. It does make sense to me. We've also completed our second lap. Hooray. We only have 11 more to go, basically. Oh, the puzzle pieces. An area I just can't go in? That's kind of weird. I mean, I guess it's just trying to stay true to the fact that it's a puzzle piece. I almost just walked in there. Ha! You thought you could best me, brain, but I outsmarted my own smarting. You knew I was going to do this. You knew it. But I stopped it because I simply looked. That's right. Never expected me to do that, now did you? You didn't think I could do it? Mainly because I didn't either. I'm not a very confident Andy, some would say. Mainly because I've proven time and time again that I'm that stupid. But it's okay. Because now I've proven everybody wrong. That's right. Alright, wow, another tin rock. Time for you to give me a small rock. Ho! Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I, uh, yeah. That isn't... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is, uh... Yeah. Yeah, Guppy, I guess. I mean, we might be able to get Guppy eventually. There's also literally no downside to it, because we have infinite keys. So, if we can get some more luck and get a bunch more drops, that might be pretty good. I mean, I'm just having fun seeing Monster Manual give us a bunch of stuff. So I'm definitely looking forward to what our entourage is going to look like after everything is over. Said we're done, done and said with. Yes. All right, we just need like one good shop to really push us over the edge. Pill. Um. I can see forever isn't going to help us that much. I don't think it will. Um. We have a lot of money. We might as well go for butt knife. Hey, reverse emperor. I'd say that counts. Unless it, like, ruins our progress, in which case I'd be kind of sad. Oh my god, the game runs so smoothly. Ah. There we go. And, yeah, no. I completely forgot ball bandages. Alright, no, we're back here. Alright, um... I don't think I care about E. coli. I think I've broken the game. I, uh, I don't think the game was meant to do this. Hmm. 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 Ah. I see, so every red room literally breaks the game. How? But please? Please. Don't do this to me. Oh god, I'm back here. 
Uh, so I had to like take it out back and shoot him. So I will keep that in mind. Let's uh. I have to really all do all that again. Uh, uh, Alright, I think I'm back. I almost just tabbed. I'm gonna assume it's the tabbing that's killing it. So I'm not going to tab from now on. But I have been semi-periodically saving. So that, at the very least, is good. Well, now it doesn't matter how we go about it. We just have to make sure we do, like, every room. Ooh, I, I could have waited on that. I've also realized we do have the angel room. I haven't defeated him yet. This is a normal shop. Cool, 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 cool. Is this chaos card? I'm not going to beat Hush with that. That's just unfair. I think I'm just going to go up and down. Yeah, if we don't run out into anything to dice shard, aka devil deal, I will just use it on that angel room and hope that we get something good out of the one reroll. That's the best we can do, anyways. That's the best we can do. No, it's not opening the map. That ruins it. I don't know what it is that ruins it. I truly do not. Like, God, that looks so cool. Like, just seeing the entire good, uh, good trip? Good trip thing, just like that. That's so cool. Wow, that's two of the, uh, trinkets for Reshaken. Like, come on. That's gonna look so cool. I wish it was completely filled, but alas, what can you do? Hey, there we go. There's Incubus. If we get lucky on the hush floor and get, like, Incubus... I've already been in here. Then... Then just maybe we have a chance. Oh, uh, wow. Well, we get a... Oh, that's right. We used the Book of Revelations, I think. Yeah, no, that makes sense. Yeah, I can't argue with that one. Oh, that's probably why we can't move... We can't look at this. Hey, Entropy. That's from a mod I just installed. I didn't think that would actually, uh be allowed. Okay, so that's why this entire puzzle piece thing isn't able to have a room by it. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. We're actually almost done. Wait a minute. This is nowhere near how good I thought we would be. Uh, well, Hush, you, uh, you better be having an off day, because so are we, and I'm not looking forward to it. I'll just get, like, Guppy. Ah... Uh, you know, what? I don't even know why I thought that it exploded. I don't even know. Wow. Yeah, no, we're almost done with this. I'm not gonna use the, uh, book of... Or the monster manual. Because I really do think that... The chances of us getting Incubus is just... Very... It would... It's not good, It's not probable. That's what I'm trying to say. But there is a slight chance that it does happen. And if it does happen... Then, well... That'd be kind of good. That would be kind of good. I don't know why there's no red room above this room, though. That's kind of weird. But it is looking like we got... I think we got very unlucky. I've done... I haven't done a whole lot of red room shenanigans. But I swear, normally, it's a lot higher of a chance to get, like, angels and devil deals. And there's only one single angel deal this entire floor. That's pretty bad. Alright, and that is literally every room. This is the secret room, and that's... Well... We do have... Can we... Alright, well, this might be a pretty good opportunity. We might be able to dice shard some stuff in here. Can't really spawn much else. But there is some soul hearts lying around. And if I'm really feeling risky and frisky and everything... I might just play this. Maybe. Okay, well, no, that was really good, actually. Yeah, we can easily make that health back. Literally, like, two, three rooms to the left. We already have it paid back. Are you gonna pay out, buddy? Are you, do you just not wanna do that? Are you just really that bad of a guy? There we go. The shard! Uh, da, da, da. Echo chamber. Da, da, da. Okay. I guess, without further ado, I could use the dice room, but I'm not going through all these rooms again, to be honest, because I only have, like... How do I have point one speed up? The point two is from Constellation Prize. Oh, Horror Babylon makes us slightly faster. Yeah, uh, let's just get to it. Alright, and here we are. 
And I don't want to open any of these because that's not part of the challenge. Although I will Emperor. Hey! Smart! I didn't even think about that. I thought we would just get another uh, fight for... Uh, whatever the heck we got last time. Wall advantages. Couldn't think of the name. I knew what it was, just couldn't think of it. So hey, we will get an actual item. So that'll be pretty good. Hopefully. Unless it's just literally like box. In which case, sad. PJs, that's probably worse. That is actually probably worse. Right, what do we get? What, what did we get? Uh, Guppy's hairball? No, we have Guppy's hairball. Am I being stupid and just forgetting something? Because we have sensor, we have holy water. Oh my god, whatever. It's gonna be its own thing. First phase hush should be relatively fine. We have sensor, slipped rib. But other than that, no, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about this. Although hush does have boss armor, so he is technically weaker. So that's the good thing about Hush. Like, there's never really a horrible time as long as you have good stats. Which, if I was trying to get peak damage, I would probably just make sure I'm clicking. A Thame is gonna be really helpful. A Thame just did probably like five percent of his health. So if he spawns people, well, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. You know, what I just realized we have Echo Chamber. We could have just used the Emperor and then just used a couple of other pills or something like telepills on this floor and it would have been fine. But no. No, I just had to be a goofy little goober and just forget about that and everything. What are you doing, buddy? Ah, anticlimactic. It's super just slow and like he's not doing a whole lot. There we go. Now if we can get some Athame procs going. There we go. There we go. That's like 10% of his HP. Good, 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 good. Please, can I get a couple of kills like while you're still up here? Please, I just need a Thame to proc like once, and then everything else will die, and then I'll be a happy guy because you'll take some damage. No, this isn't feasible. Yeah, there we go. Well, Thame, let's go. A Thame hard carry, honestly. None of our items are spart particularly. Huh. That's a new one, I think, in my vocabulary. None of our items are particularly helpful. For this, like, of course, some damage is good, but for the most part, it still has to do with that, uh, damage scaling as well. So, honestly, a, a Thame is the only thing that really sets us out. Oh, we got a second Sharp Cursor. So, I did see something spawn and move. I thought it was just the original Sharp Cursor. I saw that whenever they were heading back. Yeah, they were kind of, you could see them very briefly that they're overlapping. Now that I'm paying attention, it makes a lot more sense because their numbers are actually overlapping. So yeah, we definitely should be clicking. That's an extra 1.4 damage, which isn't a lot, but you know, it's, it's something. See, look at the move. Look at the move. Look at the cursors go. Uh, yeah, I mean, I do have 18 bombs as well. well. Bombs should be immaculate, shouldn't they? Since we're technically so weak and they do like flat 60 damage or something. Do they? I don't know. He went down right before. All right, holy water is like freezing him. Oh, bombs aren't doing a whole lot. No, they're doing a lot, actually. Hold on. They're doing, like, mild to void levels of damage. Which, I mean, I guess isn't a lot, but it's a sizable chunk. Like, these bombs should be enough to actually kill Hush. And we might actually no-hit him. I thought I was about to rip what I just sowed. Oh my god, we actually no-hit Hush. Hmm. Huh. I guess every red room is good enough to, uh... Like, be hush. Wonderful. But, that was all I wanted to know. But I hope you enjoyed, and I hope I will see you again next time. Bye.